A new chief of the International Organization for Migration laid out her vision for tackling migration on Monday and stressed the importance of the economic benefits migration can have on the countries receiving migrants. Speaking from Geneva, and Pope focused on the evidence that migration can boost economies by providing well-needed workers or new innovation. Pope recently won her bid to become the first woman to lead the UN Migration Agency, defeating the current IOM Director General Antonio Vitorino in a vote for the position. The organization has nearly 19,000 staff members working in 171 countries. The evidence is fairly overwhelming that migration actually benefits economies. And when you look at economies that have had a, a significant influx of migrants over the years, if you look at how they're performing in the future, um, we see overwhelmingly that people tend to be better off as a result of migration. Whether it's because it's fueling innovation, it's fueling um, labor supply, whether it's fueling um, the renovation or revitalization of aging communities. Communities, uh, migration on the whole is a benefit. People are coming because they're getting jobs. And if there wasn't an economic opportunity for them to take advantage of on the other side, they wouldn't come. So our goal should be increasingly to build out regular, realistic pathways for people, recognizing that there are job opportunities, whether it's high skill or low skill, and that our, our best opportunity, and this is where the EU um, leadership is, is, is especially needed, and where we've seen very important developments in this space, but recognizing that if we're really going to stop people crossing the Mediterranean on rickety boats and, and dying as they do so, we need to approach the situation far more complicated. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.